Hey guys, Ducky here, and today I'm going to show you how to create this uh, cool sunburst effect here. It's pretty easy to make, doesn't take long, so... First of all, I just want to hit Control n to make a new document. Uh, yep. Just make it 1000 by 1000. There we go. And then, what you do, head over down to here, and you want to go on your custom shape tool. And then go to shape here, and you want to find the shape. Looks kind of like a star. I'm not sure how many points, but um, it's pretty near the top for me anyway. It might be different for you, but just look for that one there. And then, yep. Yeah. Now what you want to do is just click, hold on shift, and make a well shape. And then you want to head over. Now you go up here, right? press select and select all. This is just to make it central because if you look here it's nice central coming out from the middle. Of course you can make it so it comes out from a different point but and then you want to click that one and that one. That makes it central. And don't worry it looks kind of look crappy now but uh, you can make it better in a sec. Now what we're going to do is um, deselect and then head over down to here. Now you want to make sure you've got direct path selection tool on. Direct selection tool instead of path selection tool. And then you want to make sure you when you you get highlight these middle points here. Make sure you only get these middle points. And then control T. And then now what you want to do hold shift and alt so it drags them in, makes it even. You want to drag them down to uh, it starts centering out again like that. So about that. And then apply transformation. Now you want to hit Control T again. Once again, holding Shift and Alt. And now you just want to make this bigger. Now you see how it's rounded here, not very straight. You just want to hold Alt, scroll out, and then just if you just make it bigger. Make sure holding Shift and Alt all the time, and then hit Enter to confirm it. You've got a nice straight one there. Now I'm just going to change these colours slightly. So we're going to have a nice orange. Or yellow and orange. Now what we're going to do is drag this layer and create a new layer. Which duplicate it. And then scroll out again. Just let me change, change the colour so you can see it. Uh, let's go for a dingy little colour there. And then hit control T once more now you want to come down to to a corner so you can turn it once again shift and alt then just turn it like that and hit enter now as you can see you've got like little gaps in between here and to fix that just hold shift and select both layers hold control T zoom out and then if hold shift and alt and drag it all the way out you may have to go quite far to get this but and then if I zoom in now just a little bit more maybe I'll just make sure and as you can see there you go it's got rid of all the white bits in there no white bits hit enter to confirm that and there you go nice little sunburst effect there um, Really easy to make, only takes a couple minutes and it can be very effective. And you can always make it so it comes out from a different point as well just by making the centre of your shape in a different position. Simple as that. And thanks for watching, hope you found this tutorial helpful. And yeah, goodbye.